How to change a culture is a question that I get regularly from my clients as I'm designing wellness programs. And culture shift is a huge ROI or even token to show proven results on how people are adopting healthier behaviors within a wellness program. So today I wanna to provide three ideas or considerations to help you shape your culture and encourage a, a, a change within your culture for healthy behavior adoption. The first idea is really making it about the individual. It has to be personable, a personal, it has to be, they have to be accountable, and it has to be owned by them. When you have that ownership, you can begin to start to see a change within your culture because it ultimately leads to my idea number two, which is really about making it social. We see social influence as a huge proponent to wellness programs. The, am the amount of support, feedback, reinforcement that comes when you allow people to come together socially and, and support each other in wellness is huge. So having that dynamic as part of your program. The third idea or consideration is also around environment. So creating an environment that is conducive to supporting people that want to engage in healthy behaviors, whether it's nutrition choices in a cafeteria, whether it's a walking path or access to gyms on a campus or on site where your location is, and even promoting and encouraging people to wear athletic gear once a week to get up and get moving are great ways to promote a healthier workplace and environment. So as you move forward and begin to think about design, ultimately for culture change, here are a few things that I hope will help you in that. 